All right, folks, let's get into it, man. So rapper Casino Jizzle was shot and killed today in Memphis. Now, here's what we know so far. Now, first off, we got video from the crime scene. Yeah, he's he dead. Yeah, he's dead. Did you get some shoes? No. I didn't either. I, I, his family and friends are already mourning on social media. Now, here's what we know so far about his murder. We know that he was murdered at about 6.34 p.m. Memphis time. God damn. Yo, them boys didn't even wait for nighttime to slide. Yo, that's how you know it was urgent. Now, apparently he was killed in Northwest Memphis on the 2200 block of Gold Brewer Lane. Now, the individual who murdered him, the suspect, apparently fled in a black vehicle. Now, this ain't the first time Casino Jizzle been shot. If y'all famously know, Casino Jizzle was shot at a Chuck E. Cheese. While his family and friends was inside chilling, he went outside for a brief moment and got shot up. But he survived the shooting. Now, here's the thing. When it comes to pinpointing exactly who killed Casino Jizzle or who's responsible for it, I'll be real with y'all, bro. That's damn near impossible, bro. Like, Casino Jizzle has been into it, has been beefing with damn near every Memphis rapper. But more famously, right, more notably, he's been beefing with Big Homie G. Now, for you guys who are tapped in, y'all know that Big Homie G was shot a couple of months ago as well. So this beef is ongoing and back and forth. So I'm not saying Big Homie G got nothing to do with it. I rock with Big Homie G, you feel me? I've met Big Homie G, I've interviewed Big Homie G. I'm just letting y'all know who the most famous op is. Now, these dudes could have just been beefing based on rap. Because Casino Jizzle did remix Big Homie G's single, Tick, where he dissed Big Homie G and others. So it could just been a rap. I don't know. I'm just letting y'all know, you feel me, who that man been beefing with. Now, before his death, though, he did post on Facebook how he was done with the beefing and he won for, you know, his ops to stop blackballing him from the industry. Now, for you guys who don't know, Big Homie G got ties to both PRE and CMG, right? So essentially, Casino Jizzle was saying, listen up, man. Y'all stop blackballing me, bruh. It's no smoke, it's no beef, ain't no street ish, bro. I'm just trying to feed my family. Now, it's unfortunate his life got cut short, but right now, bro, Memphis is like Chirac, bro. Memphis is like prime Chirac right now. Listen, imagine Chirac in 2012, that's Memphis currently. So Memphis is Afghanistan. Memphis is absolute right now, is war. So I don't expect that Casino Jizzle is going to be the last rapper to fall this year in Memphis. I pray he's the last. I pray nothing else happens. But right now, it's war in Memphis, man. Now, apparently people suspect that somebody dropped his location, and that's how the ops got up on him. I don't got no information about that. I can't confirm it. But when I find out more information, man, I'll be right back here letting you guys know, all right? It's your boy, Porter Flacco. I'm out of here, folks. Peace.